I'm Nick White, postdoctoral research fellow uh, working at UBC in the Department of Chemistry with Mark McLaughlin. So one of my passions is bouldering, climbing reasonably low down, so on sort of four or five meter high boulders. And you try and climb things that are quite difficult, and often you'll spend kind of a session of just trying to figure out the way to the top of this boulder, and you'll try various things. Some of them will work, and some of them won't, and eventually, hopefully, you get to the top. And that's kind of almost like a metaphor for research, where you're trying to make a particular chemical, you'll try all sorts of ways to make it, and they won't work, and you'll make a small bit of progress, and then finally you'll make your, your target chemical. Our research involves the development of new materials, especially materials that address important environmental issues. We're developing new catalysts for environmental remediation, wastewater treatment, and photovoltaics for solar energy harvesting. Nick is a new postdoc in our lab, and he is working on a project to develop new solar cells that are more efficient than ones that exist already. I'm really excited about a lot of the qualities that Nick brings to our lab. Nick has an exceptional training from Oxford, He's motivated, loves science, and has a great personality. So Mark's an, an incredibly enthusiastic chemist. He kind of bounces into the lab and, and he gives us these really good ideas and then leads us, leads us to go away and work on them ourselves. And so it's really nice having that freedom kind of to take the research in your own direction. Um, and that was one of the things that attracted me to work here. But you know, if anything ever goes wrong or you run into trouble, he'll help you out with some ideas. People don't really think about it, but chemistry is actually quite creative. You have to design molecules. You have to kind of, it's almost like being an architect, perhaps on a very small scale. Uh, we're trying to build small molecules that will assemble into larger constructs uh, that we can use to harvest solar energy and turn that into electrical energy uh, for use in solar panels. Uh, but once we get something that we think is, is a reasonably interesting hit, we're looking at collaborating with people in electrical engineering to try and build it into an actual functioning device. Getting one of these awards means you're, you're part of a, a family of academics doing hopefully interesting and useful research. Mm -hmm.